Hey, what's up everyone? Today we're diving into a super important topic that's gonna blow your mind. We all know retirement is supposed to be about kicking back, spending time with the fam, and just chilling. But guess what? New research is shaking things up and telling us we should be lifting heavy weights too. Yeah, you heard me right. Heavy lifting in retirement. So, here's the scoop. As we get older, our skeletal muscle function tends to decline. But according to a study published in the BMJ Open Sport and Exercise Medicine, resistance training can make a huge difference. Mads Block Ibenfeld, a PhD student from the Institute of Sports Medicine at Bispa Björg Hospital in Copenhagen, led the study, and the findings are pretty amazing. The study involved 369 healthy adults aged between 64 and 75. They were split into three groups. One group lifted weights three times a week, another did moderate intensity training using body weight and resistance bands, and the last group didn't change their usual exercise routines. They measured bone and muscle strength as well as body fat levels at the start, at the end of the one-year program, and then two and four years later. Here's the kicker. The group that did heavy resistance training saw the most significant long-lasting benefits. Even four years later, their leg strength remained unchanged. Meanwhile, the moderate intensity group did experience some decline, but it wasn't too bad. Now, Dr. John Batsis from the University of North Carolina, who wasn't involved in the study, emphasized that exercise is at any age. He mentioned that resistance training can improve overall health, including cognition and physical function. Dana Santas, a CNN fitness contributor, added that resistance training can involve weights, resistance bands, or even bodyweight exercises like push-ups and squats. For older adults, this type of training is crucial for maintaining muscle mass, bone density, and mobility. The study also highlighted the importance of adding heavier weights to your routine. However, Batsis pointed out that not everyone has access to a gym. So what can you do if you're working out at home? Santas has some great tips. She recommends exercises that mimic everyday movements. For example, you can do box squats by sitting lightly on a chair and standing back up. If you're feeling confident, add some dumbbells to the mix to increase resistance and improve grip strength. You can also use resistance bands for side steps, side lunges, or reverse lunges. Aim to do two or three sets of eight to 12 reps of each exercise a couple of times a week. This kind of regular exercise, combined with good nutrition, is key to staying healthy and independent later in life. As Batsy said, lifestyle changes are a major key to healthy aging. So there you have it, folks. Retirement isn't just about relaxing. It's also about staying strong and healthy. Don't be afraid to pick up those weights and start lifting. Your future self will thank you. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more awesome content. Catch you in the next video.